Hi everyone, Ada has another challenge for you. Thank you for helping me design a hockey game I can play at home. I can't wait to play it with my family. I have a new challenge for you. Have you ever played miniature golf? I call it mini golf. I played mini golf this weekend. I hit the ball with a golf club and tried to get it into a hole. Let me show you. I hit the ball like this, and usually there's objects in your way, like this yellow object, and here's a hole that I try to hit the ball into. At one of the holes, I hit the ball into a box and it came out moving in a different direction. It was like this. How did that happen? What is inside the box? Let's take a look at that video again. Notice what direction is the ball moving when it goes into the mini golf feature and what direction is the ball moving when it comes out of the mini golf feature. Pause the video to talk about it with someone. How do you think that happened? Pause the video again to talk about it with someone. Let's see if we can figure it out. When we want to figure something out in science, sometimes we make a model. A model is not the real thing, but it represents the real thing. We can't see what's inside the mini golf feature, but we can make a model to help us figure out how it works. A model can be a drawing or an object. First, we are going to make a drawing. Draw a model of what you think is inside the box on this paper. Or if you can't print this paper out, draw a model on a blank sheet of paper. Pause the video to draw your model. Yeah. Now you are going to make a 3D model. We can't see inside the real mini golf feature, but you are going to make a model that you can see inside of. Start with a shoebox lid or a cereal box cut in half. Have an adult help you cut a slot for the ball to go in and a slot for the ball to come out. What should you use on the inside of your model? You can use any materials that you find. But here's a hint. You might want to look back at the research you did on the different wall materials. What happened to the ball when it collided with these different materials? Good luck and we will test out your model in the next lesson.